Hello and welcome back to another video. It's Derek and today is a very special day. Today is December 1st, 2023 and the beginning of on-chain governance for the Cardano ecosystem. So it's my view that this day will go down in history as being a very pivotal day in the blockchain space overall as no other blockchain has achieved decentralized governance as of today, as of yet. And so today marks a very special day uh, in the approach, the attempt to actually execute on-chain governance is monumental, okay? No other chains, blockchains out there, layer ones can make that claim. And so Cardano is pioneering something incredible and it is one of the many reasons why I focus entirely in the Cardano ecosystem. When I first got into this space in 2017, it was exciting for me to understand what this technology was going to do to And Voltaire is the age of governance, it's the age of Voltaire. And so I made a decision to consolidate my efforts of understanding all these different tokens and blockchains. And I focused on Cardano. It's been one of the greatest decisions I've ever made. And every single day that I wake up and I understand more, it's validated that it was the greatest decision I've ever made. And so today, with a vote, it will mark a historic moment for me because I believe in these companies and these protocols, these missions, um, more so than I believe in value of price action. Okay, so it's about being a part of these projects for me. And it should be about you. If you are considering being involved in cryptocurrency and you're investing, is it that you just want this like, prayer for a Lamborghini or some sort of material gain? Or do you want to be involved in something historic? That's, that's changing lives, right? You know, see, I was too young to be a part of the internet revolution, which was the last major disruption of our time. And it's my view that the blockchain movement, the disruption of cryptocurrency, tokenization of assets, and gosh, I could just go on and on, it's my view that that will make the internet look like maybe the landline telephone, okay? And so today is a very fantastic day. We're looking at on-chain governance. So without any further ado, we're gonna get right into it. This is how you can begin to understand the online governance that Cardano is seeking to achieve, okay? I keep saying online governance, I'm meaning on-chain governance. And we're gonna to go to the Intersect website. Okay, so let me take you to this website, Intersect. Intersectmbo.org. This is the website that you can read and begin to wrap your mind around what's going on as far as on-chain governance for the Cardano ecosystem, okay? So building together to drive Cardano forward. Intersect is a member-based organization for the Cardano ecosystem putting the community at the center of Cardano's development, right? This is gonna be a short video. We're not gonna go into every single thing. Uh, you, can, you can click the button to be part of Intersect and fill out uh, a little bit of a form and be notified and become one of the founding members. It is, uh, here are some of the members overall, like Liquid Finance, Gimbal Labs, M Labs, Clarity, Meehan. This is, this is a beautiful, 
token, a stable token coming out December 19th, actually very soon. You got Eternal, Endmaker, WADA, all these, uh, and there's many more, okay? There's many more. Um, our one is made of many. There's many more. You can play your part. You can get involved. Here's a little bit of a, a read. You click this. You're going to read about the Cardano ballot um, in many in, in other languages. Sancho Net. Um, it's really actually an amazing ecosystem, a collaboration and consensus, building our key themes, leading Cardano forward. Okay. Um, again, they're so well written. You can read as much as your heart desires. Uh, these are like little four minute, five minute, seven minute reads. And then this is the website. Okay. Um, if you fill out this, be a part, let me click on that. Let's intersect. You can be a part of it. You can go through this founding members opportunity here. Co-design intersects starting with committees and working groups. There are many ways you can get involved and you can click this and just kind of fill out this little form. Okay. And become part of something wonderful for, for, in my opinion. Okay. And you don't have to be a developer. You might be marketing person or you're just education kind of like me, right? I'm not a developer or, um, I'm not an SPO, right? I'm not building a DAP. Um, I'm actually more for the education other, you can select the other. So it doesn't matter. Okay. What matters is that you are at least aware what's going on right now, because I'm telling you, many people do not understand in the crypto space overall, and this is happening today, and I'm helping you become aware. So because there is um, a few days, I think, to, the, the voting will stop on December 11th, so you really have 10 days to be a part of something revolutionary. Okay, and so what happens when you join this, you're gonna get an email that will talk to you about what the agenda is for Intersect, and then it'll invite you to the Discord, you can join their Discord, and then through the Discord, you can find links in the email and through the Discord that will bring you to this website here. Okay? And this is the 1694 ballot website. And we are going to do this in real time right now as we speak. It's the first on-chain vote of the members base organization with Cardano. Okay? It's going to ask me to sign my wallet well first you need to connect a wallet so i could i'll disconnect this just to show you uh, when you come in you'll have a wallet you'll, you'll need to connect one to participate and this is this is the this is the question this is the this is the 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 only question we're, we're, we're tackling today as this temperature check of the future of cardano right see cardano is not controlled by a centralized entity. You know, many people are thinking, oh, Charles Hoskinson and IOG, the Cardano Foundation, Emergo, yeah. They started and they were the federated founders, okay, that created and, and shepherded this tremendous blockchain, this community, and have since passed those reigns to the community and have delivered on their promise to continue to let go of the control of the direction of Cardano. If Charles Hoskinson fell off a cliff tomorrow, Cardano would not skip a beat. I would be sad. I, I really believe Charles Hoskinson is a special guy the likes of Steve Jobs, Jeff Bezos, Elon Musk, okay, Bill Gates. I think Charles Hoskinson has the capacity to be even bigger than those mentioned. And so it would be a sad thing, but due to the decentralization of the Cardano ecosystem, the true, the actual decentralization model of Cardano, Charles Hoskinson or... You know, some of the, the Cardano Foundation, some of these entities can disappear, go away, and the, and, the, and the heartbeat of Cardano will continue on. And so the question is, based on the current progress, should we as a Cardano community continue to develop and deploy minimum viable on-chain governance as described in six, SIP 1694? 
The SIP is a Cardano improvement proposal subject to the final approval of the SPOs. Okay. And you're going to need to connect your wallet to participate. And here we go. In real time, we're connecting it. Here are the wallets. Eternal, Flint, Jiro, Lace, Nami. So I'm going to connect my Lace wallet. Okay, you're gonna have, um, it's gonna pop up here again. We need to check if you've already submitted your ballot. You will see a pop-up message from your wallet. Please confirm with your wallet signature. Okay. And so we're going to confirm. Confirm the transaction. All done. Transaction was signed successfully. Okay, so here we are. I'm going to vote yes. And I'm gonna submit my ballot. I'm going to close that out. So vote submitted. There we go. Thank you. Your ballot has been submitted. Make sure to check back on December 11th to see the results. <sighs> so it's just a beautiful day. It's a wonderful day in the Cardano ecosystem and in the crypto space at large. Okay. See, it's not just about making gains, right? like getting Lambos and stuff, stupid stuff like that. It's crazy, the stuff people talk about when I mention crypto, when I get into conversations with crypto with people. It's crazy how they turn into like a pack of wolves. They're like, oh my God, they have no idea. It's just, it's about gains and, and it's about material. And for me, it's about being a part of this organization. And What's beautiful is that I don't really know many of the people in the organization, right? I do. I, I have a lot of communications, but there are thousands and thousands. There's actually millions of people in this ecosystem, the Cardano ecosystem, and growing every day. And so, yes, I have contacts, tremendous contacts that I cherish, and they're growing every day also. But for the most part, it's not like I'm sitting down with IOG or Cardano Foundation or Mergo or some, you know, some of the founding fathers of the Cardano ecosystem, but in some little part, I'm, I'm a founding member. And that's really a beautiful thing. So could you, you could be a part of it. You don't need a tremendous resources to be a part of this growing community. And you're a part of something that's shaping up, creating a model for tons of applications that will come the next five, 10, 15, 20 years, building on the Cardano platform building on this model, right? A lot of the other projects I'm with, like Liquid Finance, for instance, when I get done this video, I'm gonna make another one, and we're gonna look at the four proposals that they have up. We're gonna vote with Liquid Finance, okay? Because Cardano has something, has created something spectacular as far as a decentralized autonomous organization is concerned, a DAO. So with their pioneering it forward as that layer one, it allows all the Cardano native tokens, the projects, the dApps, the games, every other project to, to follow suit and allow the users to vote on the direction of those projects. So a lot of credit will be given to this Cardano ecosystem. And now is a better time than ever to be a part of this fantastic growing network okay so it's the first day december 1st you have till december 11th to uh see if you can latch on to the intersect and read for yourself some of the documents they're pleasures to read it teaches me so much about this organization overall and since going to the cardano summit in 2021 I really do feel like I'm a part of the organization with my, with my own little effort, right? By myself out here in the, in the corner of Pennsylvania, just doing my part and staying strong, weathering the storm, weathering the bear markets, not listening to the FUD, the uncertainty, the doubting, all the toxicity that you see. I like staying away from all that and I like reading these documents. Instead of sitting there reading these negative chains on negative like comment threads, these chain of texts on Twitter or X or whatever, I like reading these documents 
and learning more about what it actually is that these people have no idea about, yet they want to sit there and complain, calling it a ghost chain, you know, calling it a scam, a rug pull. It's absurd, the ignorance that many people have in this space. So I want to stand strong with this community and, and support the direction of this actual decentralization. Okay, so that's all for today. It's just a quick video. Just wanted to vote with you all here live uh, and share that experience with you. And, and I'll take it forever. I'll take this experience. I'll never forget this video. This video might go down as one of my most prized videos just because I was able to share this experience with you all. This experience that, frankly, I've been waiting to take part in since getting into this ecosystem 2018. Okay, so stay strong and we will see you soon. Thank you.